your girl Shaquana coming to you loud, live in the color. Hey, my people. Hey, my people. Welcome back to my channel. Thank y'all for liking, commenting, subscribing, giving me thumbs up, thumbs down. Thank y'all for sharing my videos. I appreciate all the love and support. It is late here. It is almost 3 o'clock in the morning. I just got off the Zodiac show with Kevin Tate. So, I'm getting ready to go to bed. The reason for the bonnet. So, I don't want to hear no comments. I don't want to hear nothing about the bonnet that I got on my head. I'm finna get ready to go to bed. But anyway, this is another episode of Woman to Woman. And I want to talk to my sisters. I need to talk to y'all. We have got to have some type of respect for one another. We have got to appreciate we have got to love on each other, okay? We are all that we have. If you cannot appreciate each other, if you cannot love each other, if you cannot support each other, we are doomed. We are doomed, y'all. And we cannot be fighting am amongst each other. We already go through a lot as it is in this world and we do not need to be fighting amongst each other black women okay we just don't we have kids to raise we have life to live we have uh stuff to conquer we have work to do in this world we have a lot of work that we need to do in this world and we do not need to be disrespectful to each other we do not need to be having hate for each other because hate turns into violence and violence turns into and turn into death and I don't have time for it. I'm busy. I, I, I got too much in, in the world to do. I got too much on my plate. I do not need people being hateful towards me. I don't need other black women being hateful. Don't, don't you think it would be a whole lot easier if we all just got along with, with each other? And work together. And if you can't get along, just stay away from each other. Stay out of each other's way. Just, why not do that? Just stay out of each other's way, y'all. Like, it don't make any sense to me for people to just go out of their way to just be mean, to be disrespectful, to be hateful, to wish somebody harm. Like, what is the purpose in that? Like, what do you get out of wishing hatefulness on somebody? Like, what do you actually get out of doing that? I don't, I don't understand that. I don't get it. It never made sense to me. I never understood it. Back in the day, black women got along for the common good, the common cause. And I don't get why we as black women cannot do that today. It's like jealousy sets in and you think somebody is trying to take something from you and I don't get that like you are so territorial no we are so territorial when it comes to things and people and a lot of these things and these people that you're territorial about don't even belong to you and you must get out of that mindset that what you're fighting over don't really belong to you. It never did and it never will belong to you. The only way it's going to belong to you is if you earn it. Honestly. 
And if you cannot earn what you want or who you want, honestly, what you, why are you being hateful? Why are you being vengeful? Why are you blocking? Why are you restricting? Hmm? Why are you doing that? It makes no sense. It's just stupid to me. It's just downright dumb to me. And I don't get it. Grow up. If you don't like somebody, never speak to them. Never have their name in your mouth. And just stay in your lane and do what you do. And don't worry about nobody else. Just do what it is that you do and you keep it pushing. Keep it moving. That's all. Just keep it pushing. Keep it moving and live your life. Because at the end of the day, that person that you're hating, don't pay your bills, don't put food on your table, or roof over your head, and money in your pocket. I'm just saying, I am just saying to y'all, think before you have an evil spirit. Think before you have a vengeful spirit. Think before you have a jealous spirit in you. Because sometimes that spirit is hard to get up off of you. I'm being, I'm being honest with you. But y'all think about what I'm saying. Comment. And in the meantime, and in between time, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell twice to be notified. If you're an old subscriber, make sure your notifications are on. Share my videos. Like I always say, God only gives you one life, y'all. Please leave it. Bye, y'all. Thank you.